Hey, how cool and convenient would this be to wirelessly charge your phone by simply dropping it on the table? Now, if you want to find out how I did that, stay tuned as I'll be jumping in right after this. Now, before I get started, if you end up liking my content, please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Also, if you want more content like this, please don't hesitate to subscribe to my channel and also hit the notification bell button. That way you can always stay informed whenever I post new content on my channel. Now let's see how the Invis Qi is different from your other wireless chargers. Okay, it says here on their site, the next generation of Qi technology, the longest distance functional wireless charger that can output 10 watts of power over 30 mm of distance. All right. So basically what that is saying that the technology that's built into this, it allows you to charge a device on a table that is no thicker than 30 millimeters or equivalent to 1.18 inches, all right? Again, it has that long distance charging function, which we will put to the test and see how this works. And this should work with just about any device that can wirelessly charge as well. So that goes from your iPhone, your Android, or any other devices that has wireless or Qi charging capabilities. Again, you get 10 watts of fast wireless charging and it also has the overheating protection that's built into it. So that way it doesn't cause any issues with burning out your device or a fire or anything like that. All right. So with that stated, let's go ahead and get this thing open and see what all this technology is all about. All right. So here we go. Lift this up. Slide down, will you? Here we go. And this is the Invis Chi itself. All right. Nice build to it. All right. And you can see your power port right there where you would plug in the cable in. All right. And this is where it rests when you have it mounted. So I guess something like this, let's see. Under the table. All right. All right, let's see what else we got here. More than likely the power supply. Absolutely. Okay. All right, so what I did is just put everything on the table that we can see in front of you because it was a lot going on and so many contents just came inside this box. So we can go over the checklist that's on the back of the manual, all right? All right, so the first one is the Invis Qi charger, which of course is this here, all right? Next is the tray mount. This is the tray mount. So this is what goes under the table. All right. And this rests on the tray mount, just like so while it's mounted under the table. All right. 3M mount tape. All right. So you have three of these. Okay. That's if you choose to use this versus the mount screws. All right. So you have four mount screws and then the black ones are the charging screws. So you can see here at the bottom, you have two holes and that's where the black screws will go to. All right. And this is what you would use to mount those screws. Use those screws to mount this to the tray. Okay. Then we have table sticker 
This is your table sticker, so that way you know where you have it mounted, and this is where you replace your device on, all right? You stick it on the table. What's next? You have the green wireless. You have the green wireless sensor. So this wireless charge sensor is used to determine if you have enough power, all right, that's going to your, that's gonna be charging your device. So once you have your sticker on the table or wherever you have this mounted, you will place this on that area and the lights would determine if you have a good power or enough power to charge your devices, all right? So it's just a tester pretty much. And last but not least, the manual itself, which is pretty thin, all right? It's not a whole lot being mentioned in here, as you can see. It tells you how to mount it, and it gives you some exchange and one-year warranty information. And that's about it, all right? So not a whole lot, but it should be straightforward. So really quick, what I'm going to do is just go ahead and mount this to the tray, stick it under the table, and that way you can see it in action. All right, so as you can see here, I do have it mounted. All right, you can see screw one and screw two in here. So I'm gonna go ahead and stick this under the table and then show you how this will work here, all right? So this is me putting it under the table. As you can see, the lights are flashing, so that way you know it does have power, and you can determine the areas that you can place your device for it to charge. Now for the time sake of the video, I won't go through on how to mount this to your table. Very straightforward. You would just go ahead and go under your table, and then from the bottom portion, you would screw those holes into your table, or you can go ahead and get this mounted with the 3M tape. The tape that has the holes in it will go on each side, and then that top one will go here, and then it will mount under your table just like so. All right, very easy. And make sure when you put it in there, you see it already has a hole for the charge cable, so make sure you put this facing backwards just like I have it here. That way you should have the charge port facing or available through that hole, all right? So once you're done with that, you should be good to go. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and stick this under the table again and then place my Note 20 Ultra in this Unicorn Beetle Pro case. As you can see, it's a little bit on the thicker side. And let's see how that works, if it will still wireless charge. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and place it here. Uh, find that sweet spot. There we go. And as you can see, it's charging just like that. And that's how this will come handy. All right. You will go ahead and find that sweet spot. Move this out the way. With this here. All right. And then you will go ahead and place the sticker, your table sticker right there. So that way you know where to place your device. And that's how it works. Very simple, very nice. You don't have to worry about chargers and wireless charger devices in a way. You have a clear table, you just drop your phone, just like that and be ready to go. Let's do one more test with the Galaxy Live Buds charge case. As you can see there, it's charging. You see the light right there. Very easy, very cool, and pretty excited to continuously test this out. I really think that this technology is next level, and I'm pretty excited about it. Now, if you're interested in getting your hands on the InvisChi, I will have a link posted in the description section of this video. And this completes my review of the Invis Qi wireless charger. I thank you for watching this video and if you liked it, please show your support by giving it a thumbs up and subscribing. 
Also, share it out and comment below. Until next time, keep it mobile.